been speaking with leaders in the International Committee of the Red Cross. Talk to me about what they're saying about the humanitarian crisis in Gaza. Yeah, Andrea, that's right. The Red Cross is telling NBC News that they are engaging in direct face-to-face -face discussions with senior leaders in Hamas about the fate of the Israeli hostages being held in Gaza. They say as a first step, they are trying to gain access to the hostages. They are trying to see what condition physically they're in, whether or not they need medical attention. They want to try to act as a go-between to carry messages from the hostages to their families and vice versa. And they say, ultimately, they are hoping to secure the release of the hostages from Gaza. I want you to take a listen to a little bit of a conversation I had earlier with an ICRC official in Jerusalem. Right now, uh, in our role as a neutral organization, we are in di dialogue and discussion with Hamas at the, the highest level um, to ensure, firstly, we're demanding the immediate release of these hostages uh, and also access so we can check on their well-being and so that we can pass messages from them to their family and vice versa. Now, Andrea, the Red Cross would not go into detail about what is being said in these discussions. They say they can't in order to maintain their position as a sort of trusted independent mediator, which is a role, as you know, that they have been playing since before the First World War. Um, but they say these talks are ongoing and they are committed to keeping the families of the hostages informed.